What's up, you guys? Welcome back to Terrifying Crafts. It's fr Friday. What day is it? It's Friday. Friday. It's Friday night. It's and Friday. I have no clue where I'm at. In the big town. All right. All right. Uh, da, 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 da. Uh, last week, started working on new building for the... for the diorama that we started that continuously gets messed up by cats so I'm going to have to continuously repair it however though I've got to repair it it's no biggie it's an easy fix and there goes the dog before she messes up my camera alright Welcome to whoever's in over on Facebook, even though I'm pretty sure it's my wife. Hi. Hey, you guys. All right. I'm here. So, I'm going to bounce down to the table, and we're going to get started. Transition. Ta-da. There it is. Now I need to move my keyboard out of the way. She said, give me a second, I'm playing my game. So I was kind of going to be doing background noises for it. <laughs> All right. First things first. Before, before I get to going, I'm going to mix up one of my uh, Rays on the Go's. That way you guys can see it. There you go. Nope, maybe. Ah, there we go. Raise. On the go. These things are delicious. Definitely worth checking out. Website is repsports.com. And I would give you a code, but I've got to make sure that that code works real quick before I start sending people to it. So, mix that up real quick. Ugh. Done. And then, obtained the glue. And then figure out exactly where this thing was supposed to be the first time. And glue it back into place in roughly the same place. Using some just bog standard PVA. Well, a, a, a quote unquote uh, premium all purpose adhesive. In English, it's just PVA. For anyone who doesn't know what PVA stands for, that's polyvinyl acetate. Which means it's glue! Alright, so back to this. Uh, off camera. I ended up building a top for this. Um, part of that is because I finally decided on exactly which direction I was going to go with it. And so in order to go in that direction, well, I had to do some finagulating. So, back to the polyvinyl acetate. And we are going to... that down now as you may notice there is something different on the inside of it which I will get to in a moment uh, alright now that I got the glue on there 
I am going to lay this on top of it that way and there we go. as I lay it on there I'm going to scooge it around a little bit for a couple of reasons what that'll do is kind of remove any of the air pockets that are around the glue or underneath the glue so it ends up adhering a little bit better right off rather than being like some glues and having to wait for it to solidify there we go all right now as to on the inside move that up toward the camera back that all right on the inside i had found this uh i really don't know what to call it uh, it was a base to a C-3PO thing that I had gotten, and I don't remember exactly what it came from, but it looked kind of cool and kind of like a uh, like a high-tech computer or something like that. I've got to go in and fill in the gaps to it, which I'll probably end up just using foam core for, just because the foam core itself is right at thick enough to where as I lay it in there, if you can see it, it ends up filling most of that gap, or almost all of that gap completely. Um, and I can push it in there around the, uh, the stick that's in there and get it roundabouts to where I want it. Um, can you give me the pencil? Thank you. All right, and then I'm gonna use my pencil to mark where I need to cut it. And pull it back out. And one cut, like a glove. And truthfully, thinking about it, I should probably flip that upside down and cut another one to match. <coughs> and then slide it back in accordingly. There we go. And from the look of it, I may not have to do whole lot of gluing to it. So it looks like these are just going to slide into place and fit the first time. Can't go wrong with things working out the first time, right? <clears throat> Alright, there's that. And I'm not worried about the back. I'm more worried about the front. Aesthetically. So. Trim out a piece of foam. And we're going to stuff that right there. There we go. And it fits mostly perfectly. Mostly perfectly. And there we go, and it fits mostly perfectly. Now I need a wedge for the center of that, but I didn't notice I needed it before. Welcome to everyone that is popping in on Facebook. Hi, Tim. Hi, Tim. It's not big enough. There we go. And by the way, I'm also going live over on Facebook as well as Twitch and Twitter. Uh, I can't see how many people are in on Twitter, but 
Your phone died? Yeah, I shared a camera body and then it died. Well, that sucks. I'm sorry, your phone died. Okay. Then go lay down. Okay. I love you too. What's that for? Oh. Okay. I'll remember that. Talk about the elephant in the room. No. Oh. Hmm. Toasty. Alright, now that that's done. I can stop measuring and start eyeballing. Cut a piece out. Lay it against the thing. Figure out exactly how big I need it to be. Alright. Then, I need... Straight edge. That I'm not finding. Even though I know one exists, there it is. It's at the bottom of the container. Hmm. Lay that there. And watch my sausages so I don't snip one. Check it. some gap filling to do, but that's fine. Mom was asking, did you say that you were snipping on sausages? S snipping. 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 S-N-I-P-P-I-N-G. Snipping. Snipping. Sheesh. Don't need to be snipping off my sausages. <laughs> my big old meaty fingers. I mean, I could probably sniff them, but I don't think it'd feel too pretty. I'd prefer not to lose my phalanges. Lots of glue, lots of glue, lots of glue. Ooh. There we go. And stick it in place. Wiggle it around. What that glue clean ish. I need to do a lot of gap filling. Man, I cut that way wonky. Oh well. I have wedges. And the gap fill primer I'm going to use on it before I paint it is going to end up benefiting me this time. And... There we go. Kinda. Maybe. Maybe. I don't think that I don't think I got it. Nope, it didn't, but oh well. It'll be fine. Mom, 
Why my phone? Butthole. Man. Messaging everybody and their dog with my weird goofy face. There you go. Alright. Now that I got that done. I need to build up some walls. And I don't think that this is going to be enough foam cork to do that. I also need to tilt my fan a little bit more so it's actually facing me. There we go. Welcome to whoever uh, came in over on Facebook. All right, so first things first, before pulling the paper off of this, probably should have used a, use a bottle of water or something. Ew, I didn't notice that. Good thing the paper's coming off, that's grody. Do some measurement. Almost exactly five. Problem is, I guarantee the bottom one's not. And I'm not. Well, it's right around. It's not bad. That one leans a lot more. Okay, so both of them are around five by, I'm going to say, four, four and some change, I'll say four and a half, script, four and a half, four and a half by five. Oh, okay. Got it. Move my tea over. No. Set my tea there. Because I'm drinking this one. But I'm going to drink the tea real quick. Okay. And I am going to... Move that over to that. And I am going to click there. And I am going to share that to people yeah I'm sharing the YouTube one because though I enjoy the the Facebook's I'm also doing this on the YouTube's too So let's see what we can do. All right. Now, I'm going to call that good. Move that there. And let's do some measuring. Ten. Five. It's going to have to be. 
Check that against that. It ain't perfect, but I don't particularly need it to be way too bad. It's perfect. Working on it. Three, four, three, two, one. Blast off. Then again, I'm also in another room. She also said, "I swear I'm not hearing you correctly." Measure twice, cut once. I still suck at doing that, but measured it twice. Now it's time to cut it the once. Welcome to whoever came in over on the Facey Books. We are currently rebuilding a building. AC was making too much noise. Okay. We're rebuilding a building for the spacey crashed diorama thing. Welcome to whoever came in over on Facebook. I could have swore you said said I'm going to bit off I own P what hi Sam hi mom other mom that's sitting beside me okay that one goes that way so, half of that. It's nine. So, it's 4.5 tall. No. I said I could have swore you were saying I had to bite off some BB, but I'm like. What? That's what I'm wondering. It's got a lag in it, see? It does that, so, okay, you remember what happened to Janet Jackson when... Oh, yeah. All right, you yeah, so, so whenever it's you go so live, it, it's, That's it's pretty funny. a two-second lag behind. That is pretty funny. So that's like if something happens, oh, it happens or something, you can hear it in your mind. <laughs> Which, what? I mean, most of that... In the, most of the audio side of things gets edited out whenever I'm editing for uh, for YouTube, but Sam's on. 
I know, but he ain't. He has not commented yet. I see. I see that he's there. I do. I do see that he is there. And I measured twice, cut once, and I still failed to get it the right size. Right, oh. You know what? You hush. You. you I've de oh, shoot. I've determined it a few times, but which? What's weird is I legitimately took classes that required me to measure a lot. And yeah, nope. I went to school for welding for freaking crying out loud. It's kind of hard to be a welder if you can't measure. No, no, I'm not. That is a very valid point. I didn't finish that class. I got kicked out of it because I got my lip pierced. All right, so there's that. Now, I'll figure out which side of this is which in a second. It's a good thing I can at least cut a straight line. Ha, 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 ha. All right. So, excluding me, Arwen, and... Uh, Stacy, because she didn't have a choice. She had to sit through it because I put it on. Even though I doubt she really paid attention to it. <laughs> Anyone else started watching uh, She-Hulk yet? Everything's plugged in. Nothing's plugged in correctly. I think part of it's not being able, not being able to take the, uh, the other normals. Till I got home. I don't know, sweetie. Apparently, measuring correctly but incorrectly. All at the same time. Which is weird. But you know what? There is one upside to having this thing already placed. With a little bit of work. Another upside is I'm using PVA, so the glue itself takes a minute to dry, meaning gives me time to do that. And then come to realize that the piece I was trying to glue in wasn't even the piece I needed to be gluing in. Man, I'm a genius. However, it may end up saving me some trouble. Because I just realized what I did wrong whenever I started the uh, process of cutting it in in the first place. Okay. And I'm not going to wedge any of this. I'm going to... Huh? Wackadoo is... Wackadoo was green anyway. No, he had like a brown on Oh. He's as green as that thing right I was fixing to say, Wackadoo's supposed to be green. I know, he's a green tree frog, but he was turning the color of the rest of the foliage in there. Oh, that's cool. But he's back to the green that he's supposed to be. Get all that glue off my hands. Itch my nose. Ugh. I was misting you. 
This one is going to need a wedge, but that's okay. My lower back hurts. I'm sorry, sweetie. This dude, this is an actual insane. <clears throat> she said no, we're trying to pee. Yeah. Well, I mean, he was in here talking, all that was going on, and that's what he said. And you were like, oh, I thought that he said, and I was like. I think. It had something to do with me asking him if he had to turn off the AC. Uh, okay, well, I turned off. I needed to bite off the pee. <laughs> I mean, it could be. This is me we're talking about. I am the king of random weird stuff. I'm not the king of... ADHD moments, but I am the king of random weird stuff. Welcome to whoever came in over on Facebook. Hello, did I take this other book? Yeah, okay. I told Nick one day we need to get live and try to build something. And actually do something. Get built. Yeah. And try to build get drunk and draw. I told him I, I do that anyway. I told him that we should do that too. We should get drunk. I mean that's the easier, quicker what I told him is we should get drunk and then him start first part of the drawing. Let you finish it. And then let me finish it. Fixing to say, that's not a me phone call. Without, without you watching the thing. Oh, that's hilarious. Okay, there's that. And this time... I know it fits because I've already tested it. Which I should probably do anyway. I don't know why I didn't the first time. And I don't need those one sides because it should slide right into place. Alright. Once it's slid into place, take this extra piece of foam, start doctoring up certain things. A little bit, some. Then figure out why I've got a smudge on my glasses. It's kind of hard to do stuff if your eyeballs are clogged. He said, no, I ain't sleepy yet. It's the weekend. Well, not for too long. You still need to go to bed at a decent time. That way you're not messing up your sleep schedule for during the week. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm a horrible example of going to bed at a decent time, but... Because I really am. Because I don't ever go to bed only at a decent time. Then again, I spend way more time working on stuff than than I probably need to for health reasons but eh it'll be fine I'll make up for it later um okay not sure why that kicked me out of the live Well, I, I'll be dead. I don't know if I'm still streaming. Let's pull this up and see.
Okay. Well, I might be. Shoot, I don't know. Yep, I am. As long as I'm still streaming on one platform. If you can't find me on the one, go to YouTube. I'm over there. Okay. Let's see, let's see, let's see. First things first. I need a wedge for that. So. I need to figure out exactly how much I need to cut off of that. Starting there. I'm working my way at an angle. We're going to try that. <laughs> like a glove. Sweet. I always love it when a plan comes together. Even though that really wasn't a plan, it was more of a haphazard guess that worked out in my favor. But whatever. You know, technicalities. Welcome to whoever came in over on uh, on YouTube. Even though I'm thinking it might be me. But I'm just going to go with it and see how well it works. There we go. And there we go. Get some glue and done. Glue and done. Maybe I should probably put glue on the other side too. Win it out. Glue the whole thing. Be a madman about it. There we go. All right. Now that I've got that, I am going to have to start making decisions, big decisions, happy accidents. Oh. That wonderful moment when you're in the middle of doing something and you forget exactly what the initial idea was. I remember what the initial idea was. Haphazard Island built thingy. Got it. Now that I'm back from that. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to ADHD Brain, where most of what you think of you forget unless you write it down and then you're like oh hey wait a minute and there's nothing wrong with it it's just part of life so you get used to it eventually and you find ways of coping It'll be the glue. I was going to say, is that the one I was using? It looks like it. Use that to smooch in that glue into the cracks and crevices. And try and blend it out. There we go. I did a thing. And now just use my finger to clean up the rest of it. Even though it's going to dry clear. Alright. And you know what? I'm going to use a pencil lid. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Got the hiccups. clean that up. Alright. 
And though, I probably shouldn't because then you're not going to be able to see. Hmm. To do some sketchy <coughs> doo -do 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 -do. and I'm gonna try something. Cause now that I'm not watching it, huh? Okay, cool. All right. So now that I got that done. I probably should have built this better in the first place, but I didn't, and it happens. Had to go and use crooked stuff. Now I have some, I'm going to have some heck of a time doing some cleanup on that. Oh well. Let's go ahead and build the second layer, and maybe we can make it work. Hmm. You know what? No. I am going to <coughs> measure this correctly this time. As soon as I find the measuring bit. Alright. Let's see. That's wonky sizes, but that's what happens when you guesstimate things. One is 6.8, and I don't know why. Now I know. There we go. Work this down just a little. Take the tip of that toothpick off too. Or matchstick or whatever the whatever the original material was because I don't remember it's wood it's something wooden okay now let's try that again let's see if I can get cleaner measurements okay let's see that's six six that's six six Would you look at that? 6.6. .6. Ha ha. 6.6 .6 and I'm going to call it 8.5 because that's that's where we're at is 8.5. One way, six, the other, <coughs> and then I need to decide exactly how tall I want it to be. Eight point five. Seven. Get your cat. Here. I know what she's doing. She's chasing that that mayfly. And I'm going to say, just because the other ones were, what was it, 4, 4.5, yeah, 
So we'll go four and a half. And we'll go four and a half. There. Exactly. It was eight point five, right? I said eight point five. It's right under eight point five, so let's see what we got. We got eight point five. And eight point over. That's at eight point five. Meaning that right there. Put that at squared. Or it should have put that at squared. It did. Put that at squared, and at squared. Meaning that, so long as that's flat, against that line, and against that line, that should be right, but it's not. And I know it's not, because I can see that it's not. It's bugging me. No wonder it's bugging me. There. <coughs> and. Oop. And. <coughs> there. <laughs> and of course it's my own hubris and stupidity that almost bungled that one up there we go figured it out I did it I did it Locus with a sharp blade usually helps if you use a straight edge but at this point I'm so used to having to do work to clean up the piece that that I'm assuming this will be good enough then again, you know what they say about assuming. Yep, and other stuff that you probably shouldn't be saying. <laughs> yep. Your cat is behind the TV. Or something is back there. I can hear it messing around with stuff. I just don't know if it's behind the TV or behind the... Uh... Yeah. See, I knew something was back there.
Way to go, kiddo. Yep. It decided it was its time to go. I am done here. Alright. Even though the line is not Luke, it is no, I am your father. Yep, yeah, probably. Yep. It's one of them it's one of them Mandeli effects. You killed my father. Which, in hindsight, Luke, I am your father. Yeah, it's James Earl jo James Earl Jones. <laughs> the fact the fact that it was just James Earl Jones's voice was just enough to go. Oh, you know what? Yeah, yeah, you're the father. <laughs> yeah, Luke. We don't. We don't. We don't even need an episode of Mari to figure that out. No doubt, you is the daddy. <laughs> they need to put Talk, Mister Lies, all lies. I am talking. I had to concentrate because I had to measure. Lies. What? Talk, Mister Lies, all lies. I think that's what she's telling me to do. Is just talk lies, all lies. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how to take that one either. <laughs> nah, it's fine. Alright, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Yeah, that, that makes more money. That would be funny. You're not. They lost me. You're not my real dad. <laughs> yeah, I don't have to listen to you. No, but Luke, I am your father. Truthfully, either way makes sense. It's just how much sense does one side of it make over the other? Like in the end, it really it's one of those things. It's just like meh, doesn't really matter. It works. Oh, they didn't mess it up. Disney just straight bungled it all together. The time, the that's the thing is the timeline is still there. The timeline still works. It's just okay. Some of the best movies that Disney has done, live action wise, as far as graphics and things like that were the newer Star Wars movies in terms of like uh, a appeal in a visual sense. The problem is is that the movies were so anti-George Lucas that it killed the whole Star Wars. She said, no, the Luke, I'm your father. Gosh. Welcome to whoever came in over on Facebook. Uh, if y'all aren't subscribed over on the YouTube channel, come check it out. I am currently live on YouTube as well as Facebook. Yeah, you don't have to tell me. I can see it. I have four on the book of the book of faces on Tearfin Crafts. And maybe it's the the name. Maybe the name is just hard to. Hard what to is it with this dadgum fly, man? I know I don't stink. Yes, I know. However, it didn't get away. Um, your crab escaped. What? I will um go uh and help. Hey. Take that. What? Oh, it's a fly. Hey, do you want to eat it? No, don't give it to the cat. Throw it away. <laughs> Jeez, child. She even did the... <laughs> hmm. 
Which one and how did he get... If you're talking about Sanguinus, I want to know how he managed to get out. I follow on YouTube, but don't get any notifications for some reason. Well, part of that is probably because here lately I haven't had a lot of video posts. He pushed out the grief um, where the shells were on. Oh. So, so was it Sanguinus? Yeah. I yeah. Muscle leave, leave it to the freaking... Uh, the blood angel to be the one to push the dadgum thing around. And he's huge. He is. I mean, for a small crowd, he lifts. <laughs> okay. Uh, to anyone who ends up watching this after the fact, or uh, Sam, if you haven't seen the uh, the crabs. I follow on YouTube, but don't get any... That Okay, now, as to following on YouTube but not getting any notifications... Uh, I don't know if it's notifying people whenever I go live on there. Um, however, uh, part of the no notifications is stemming from the fact that I haven't posted a video in a while. And so... How is he supposed to? There is someone in his bed. He can go in over. It's, he's this big. Okay. If not, he does he take a lot. He does. Listen, Linda, I don't want to hear about no one taking no bed, Mr. Starfish himself. But, uh, <laughs> hopefully, after after I finish this live, uh, I will be able to get a bit more editing done on the video I'm working on now and get it posted on YouTube uh, by... I'm going to say by Sunday, just because the rest of the filming and the audio work and all of that I'll have to put in after the fact um, but but there's a lot of butts and I've forgotten what but I was talking about I don't remember but uh, thank you for following me over on on YouTube that's that's a plus. And on the Facebooks, that's a plus too. And I really hope that is uh, squared because if it's not, there's really no fixing it. Looks like a workbench right now. Okay. The other one was supposed to be 65 but 6.5 ain't gonna work because I have something taking up about a millimeter or shoot two millimeters Daggum, this stuff's thick so we are looking at 6.4 6.4 or 64 millimeters uh, do, 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 do. And how tall did I do that? Oh, I don't remember. This one's a surgery thing. I think it's 4.6. Uh, I don't know. Uh, yes. I don't know what these two are. But so that ended up being... 4... 46? 45? 46? 40? Forty-five. I'm just gonna call it forty-five. I'm gonna call it forty-five and say that that's that's exactly what I need. But I need two of them at six point four. So six point four means it needs to be twelve point eight. And I'm going to smidge that over to twelve point eight. And I'll figure out what I'm doing with the front of it in a minute. Mark that there. Mark that there. And then we're going to go... To kill him. Meaning that... Look here, dude. As soon as I'm able to see... Lighting adjustment away. 
We are going to go there and go all the way down to there. Make sure both sides of that are lined up along the line. They are. And then real quick, I'm going to mark 6.4 there. And 6.4. Move that down so it's actually setting where it's supposed to, and 6.4 there, <coughs> making it even. And <coughs> ah, ah, ah. look at that, folks! For the first time in a long time, I measured something correctly. Now I've just got to cut cut it co correctly. Yeah. Upside for me, once I get lighting out of the way, which is weird because this should be a lot brighter than it is. I am not for sure why these are not as bright as they should be. Who will? I will figure that out on a later, or at a later date. Okay. All right, one second, folks. I'll be right back. Folks, I'm back. All right, gonna finish this up right quick. Then, as soon as I get this done, oh, nope. and get that cut out as good as I can which is fine even if it's not accurate because I'm going to have to tool it anyway I always do alright get that make sure I'm on the line All right, there we go. Walls are had. Now, we're gonna go in.
with a file, trim it up real quick, edge it up, clean it up. top end up first there we go all right now that I have two mostly even pieces that are mostly even not completely even oof. no one measurement was off but it wasn't off that far wonderful thing about working with uh, precision files is I can just put the two pieces together hold them together with a little bit of force long enough to where I can get them mostly even all right and now that they are mostly even in order to glue them in place, I need, where'd it go? There it is. That. That extra thick CA glue. That I forgot, I'm almost out of. All right, put the cap back on it. Find the flap. Figure out which side I want to be on the glue and which I want to be on the ground. And then after I get that glued in and positioned where I need it, because if you watched the last video I posted on YouTube, I uh, ended up having to break a piece apart and re glue it because I didn't get it glued exactly where I wanted it the first time so in order to keep me from having to do that again make sure I glue it right the first time and get it positioned correctly makes it easier for me all right there we go I'm gonna glue that in Follow that guide straight down, even if it doesn't end up completely flush on one end, as long as it ends up straight up and down uh, this way, rather than tilted in or leaned, it should end up working. There we go. Oh, nope, apparently not. Apparently there we don't go. There we go. Got it that time. Now let's move everything back in place. And actually, since that one's starting to come apart, I can do this real quick. Oop. I can knock my light real quick, and I don't want to do that. Okay. Do that. Do that. Use a spare piece of foam to smooge that glue back and forth a little bit. So 
since I'm not able to really wiggle the piece as much as I may want to. All right. And for right now, there is the piece. Now, I'm going to end up off camera. I'm going to end up continuing this out forward. Uh, making sort of like a, a medieval uh, typed building with that overhang. Uh, and then from there finish up the walls and add a door of some sort. And I think I'm going to call it good at that. But for right now I am going to slide this back down, first of all, real quick, and move back to this one right, y'all. Transition. All right. So, thank you all for coming in. Uh, didn't get as much work done as I was hoping to, but it happens. Uh, outside of that... Uh, hopefully Sunday I will have another video posted up on YouTube for you guys to check out uh, until then you guys have a great one and I'll catch you all next time